Hasbro Day, we're playing another Union Camp Advancement Time. Again, picking up with the IDA School um, 3, going through this virtual reality game we got going on. But first, we have to go make more friends, I guess. So we need to go to the IDEA Operations. Oh, well, yeah. I guess the main story telling is the priority quest I have set, but... Um... Oh, they literally just dropped me where I just was and said, find it. Okay, I think it's on like the third floor. That's on this floor. Oh, look, I haven't been here since we did the last uh, IDA school, so like, no, I don't remember. I do remember it was like a Harry Potter-esque hidden in the wall kind of portal. You know, classroom 9 and 3 8. Um, are those like some kind of like avatar-esque pods I got behind them? No, it's too tragic. Let's not talk about it now. I'm still trying to find the optimal mic placement. I had to like rearrange the stuff on my desk. There's a sparkly thing back here, which is... Oh, another one of these heart... Ugh. I knew I didn't collect all those. Okay, what is the deal with these pods, guys? Well, yeah, the arrow tell me to. Um, is that... Yes? So, are you a supportive person or not? The operator is now friends with us, so now we have a party of three? Friend points. In your adventure, you will find your friends in the game role. Hang out with them at Port Lazona. You'll receive friend points. If you gain friend points and talk to your friends, your friend rank will increase. When this increase, this friend will help you out even more in-game. Just like real friends. Alright, well, let's talk to everybody. No, nope, they're not going to help us. Oh, uh, Cerebrum Pod is a machine that allows you to go. Oh, so it is basically a virtual simulator. Straight out Avatar. Oh, it's just how I go back into Saki's dream world if I miss something. Okay, what's the next step in this quest? Oh, in the game world. Ah, oh, I gotta walk all the way back. Okay, you know what? Screw it. We can, we can teleport to the, uh, my dorm, yes. Oh, thank God. We're back in it, <laughs> just like real life. Leave for leave for forty five minutes, talk to somebody, come back, you're right back in the game world. Reminds me, Destiny One first came out. That's pretty much how my life was for like a month. We're back, Aldo the Archer. After that, I'm gone. All right, it's fine, Operator. I did go back and buy Aldo's like first weapon, so he can he's a bit stronger now. So we and then we got like a lot of a couple levels up just because I wanted to see how that all worked. I've not done any skill points yet because I think the heads up because apparently there are none of skill points to fill your trees out, and you have to be careful. Touch the soul skill to see what kind of skill there are. Wow, this is a really funky skill tree. It's like apparently you can't get all these, which makes sense. Oh, is this like a the way out? But I mean, it's okay to start here. We had to go to the start at the beginning anyway. Quick, we're 50 p.m. and some Okay. I, I, I have to get these two regardless. Ooh, poison arrow. Shot damage and single target and inflict poison. So now I have my choice of these guys. This one is fire arrow or anti-guard. Shot damage is on all enemies and reduce physical resistance by three turns. For 50%? That sounds better than fire. Fire is very uh, situational. But people will always need, people will always have physical resistances. 
I think we have to that one anyway to get to the thing. Unset, uh... Okay, I mean, I get this is supposed to be a game within a game. That's a little counterintuitive. Okay, so it's operator at... This thing's telling me to go here, so it's operator here? Oh, yeah, she is. She's just like everybody else. How was I supposed to know? Great, our friends here. Let's go to the bar. All right, no, 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 no. We gotta talk to you. Uh, collecting weapon materials from the meadow, flock of smile lilies. Oh, I know what those are. Okay, a monster will be nice. Only one at a time? Yes. It's like, hmm, perfect timing. There's some trouble. Commotion, you say? We'd call the guards, but we think the adventurers are better suited for this. Alright. Like, uh, party. Operator, friend rank one. She's level five at least. Uh, flash on the shield and water bomb. Okay. No healing yet, but... You know... An extra person takes some damage is better than nothing. At the very least. So I'm messing, I'm making sure my cable's in place. I don't want to repeat what happened last time. Because there was a long time. Like I think I, think I played for like an hour last time before the, that all happened. What's up? Is the repeat what happened last time? The Empire, you say? Oh, it's actually called Castle Town. You save your travel there, and you also save your travel there, and you third save your travel there as well. There are probably a lot of MMOs. I think the most egregious one of those I ever ran into, which took me out, out of the any kind of illusion ever, was Final Fantasy XIV. Even though I like Final Fantasy XIV, it is a good MMO. Uh, was you literally had to go this go to this person and talk, and it's like, oh, Crystal Warrior, Savior of the Realm, and then there's like literally 90 people around you watching the same cutscene about how you're the you're the like the Savior of the Realm. It's like, oh, they don't feel as special now. Like it's different if it's like instant soft, or there's nobody around, and you're talking to an NPC. When the NPC is like in the middle of a field, and you literally see everybody, it's like, oh, come on. All right, now we got three people and a better bow. Much better bow. Show me these things, right? These are the smile lilies? Yes. And they're weak to stabbing. Oh, we okay, I, I know there's five though, that's fine. We'll just kill these guys really quick to get that quest out the way. Oh, do I not control? I didn't even take a look at that. Do I not control operator? Oh no, it's just by default her her default is attack and restore. Awesome. That seems a little broken for you for your like your mage healer to be who default had to be like, I damage enemies and heal the party with every attack. It's like that's cool, but a little game breaking. Alright, you have the five, but you know what? There's six of them here, so. Uh, join your friends. In the Shadow Realm. Okay, uh, let's see they're still red. I mean, they'll probably kill us. I mean, we may try. We'll do the story first, and I'll try to take out a red dude. Oh, 
Oh, salamanders. Wait, the Empire? They're monsters? Oh, that's right, they took, they took the mana. Oh crap, is it we have to fight the freaking four elementals again in this thing? Also explains why they give you Operator for this fight because she has conveniently has Water Bomb against Salamanders. Now behold, the Savior and Savior and Third Savior. Alright, does your water bomb single? Oh, it's everybody. And all that you have your anti guard, so yeah. Oh. That was a little easier than I thought it was going to be. Money's nice. Those ID bits, I you need tons of them to buy anything. Eh, well, we fought those things in real life before. It still shocks you when you get hurt? Damn. It's hardcore VR. True, but we're not exiting quite yet because I do want to take on a red guy because I'm stupid like that. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, it's a freaking it is a freaking ogre. Okay, so the flower lilies, which were just up until now orange, were level five. So we're level six now. This guy is still red. He must be, what, 10? 20. Oh, we're screwed. Yep, we're screwed. All right, one more time. Still alive. Like, it was worth a shot. That also means we got to sit there and farm out a crap ton of those little dudes to to uh, be able to move progress if that's level 20. Or find a super high level friend who can just carry us across. <laughs> just like real MMOs. One mana scroll, please, and $500. And the new quest is already ready. Ooh, Raptor Raptors. Ooh, power you, band of power you say, in the desert. Yeah, we can't get to the desert though. Okay, so basically the Raptors are the next one we can do. We'll just start it. Oh wow, there's overworld quest in here too. Alright, let's keep going. I'm curious how this is all going to connect together with the dream worlds. I have faith that someday you shall be able to defeat the fire mana. But not today. The commander is to see you. Now be gone. Nah, alright, fine. At least it's on the first floor on the way out. Alright, what do we got here, huh? Oh, okay. Money's still good.
Obviously. Oh, so now the dither's unlocked. So basically I got to accept the questionnaire I couldn't go to before I did this part. Nice. Have we seen the princess yet? I wonder who she's modeled after. If it's actually me, that'd be awesome. Defeat the fire mana's great familiar in the desert. Okay, uh, that's gonna be tough, but... With 500, can I buy better armor? Or it, no, you can only buy weapons, right? And the next bow costs way too much money. Of course, if we get 500 per quest, I'm just gonna hold off for the shock bow. All right, little kid, what you got? Okay, you know, I will do that, but I will not hold up this to go help her find a present for her mother. We need to focus on... Oh! So instead of sparkles that are items, we find bugs. Interesting, interesting. I wasn't even paying attention to them. I thought it was... I thought it was just part of the game. Well, I mean, it is part of the game. It's just... I thought because it's an incomplete MMO, it was just like, oh, that'll be fixed later, you know. <laughs> Day one patch and all. All right, so we have to go kill that thing. Sweet, now we can just warp here when we feel like it. Um, raptors. Okay, we got we can do the kill raptors. I think raptors are weak to piercing too. So, ow. I'm gonna just kill these raptors. I mean, yeah, like, if the if there's no, like, level restrictions to equip gear, I'll just hold off and buy the best bow for all that I can. It's just, like, there's, like, two more quests. Oh, this is not a raptor. Cockatrice! All right, well, ooh, we got five dollars for killing that cockatrice. Ooh, a lot of EXP, though. Damn, I still need one more raptor. So I guess I have to go find one more, and then we'll pursue the story. Okay, so we killed all the raptors we need to complete the quest, and we're all level seven now, so we can go do this. Well, see, those things actually look menacing. Wow, that is goofy looking. I guess if you're fighting them like in like 3D, it'd be scarier. Uh, anti. I was right, she doesn't, she doesn't have uh, 100 magic points yet. Anti guard, elemental shield. Ow. Uh, poison arrow, striking blade, and water bomb. Ow. I think I overthought that. Gonna explode? Might as well go full dot hack on us. Well, that's what beta versions are. Have you been on Steam? All right, we healed up and turned that quest in. It appears like all the quests give you 500 ID bits, regardless. So I'm gonna do the, the uh, cockatrice quest after this and uh, looking for bugs right now and then just buy all those freaking shock bow and then it'll get the strongest weapon he's can possibly get well strongest weapon available to us right now of course there'll be some elemental person that it won't work on because it's shock damage but strong is strong uh, glitch told you you're beta testing 
there any glitches in here? This game's like, game's like a lot of polish. Like, where's the proof? No, I didn't say anything. Yeah. As in she's too young or you're too old? Might there be a fend your honor? You want to throw it down right now because I'm the savior. I think I can take you. Um. Oh, wasn't it, wasn't it difficult to say at all, was it? Wait, did you say news flash? All right, to the town square. I think. Uh, so here is kidnapped in Castle Town. Okay. Working on it. Saviors ho! Here we are. The site of one kidnapping. Oh, it's not me, you. Wealth. Uh, okay. Oh, this is Cerberus. Now I see where this is going. Hesmina, you work for IDEA, you should know what that thing is. It has to be in a report or two, especially if you're that into the dream world stuff. Um, Aldo, you're gonna speak up about this? Aldo, you know exactly what that thing is. You've run into it several times. Yes. Damn it. <sighs> the army has important tasks protecting their kingdom. They can't possibly go rescue the kidnapped princess. I didn't even get a chance to say yes. All right, we'll see if we get to the gorge this time, then we'll call it good at this episode. Okay, we're at the gorge. There's only four cockatrices in here, so I was unable to complete that quest, unless there's cockatrices in the gorge, but we'll see. If not, I just gotta come back and kill one more. Then it's shock bow time. Oh, this is bad. We don't actually get to see the, uh, don't know, see the map. 
You're some kind of fire elemental, fire ghost. Oh, really? You summoned an ally? Yeah, uh, he's meant to get destroyed by a cockatrice, so she's really low on health. And I can't heal people outside of here. I'll go back to the town. Well, actually, I guess I'm back to town now and heal. Oh, wow. Fire slug. Oh, lava snail. Close. Oh, I also went back in town and bought all those new, uh, bow, so. He is very strong now. Another fire snail. Oh, that's right, his bow has a chance to, like, uh, stun him because it's shock. So that works out well. Okay. Oh, hell. Um... Yeah, okay, that was bad. <laughs> that could have gone very poorly. Ah, uh, what? Ah, uh, spoke too soon. Thank you, Aldo. Uh, pass. Ah, well, we got pretty rocked by those lava snails. We may not make out this alive. Like, if this thing doesn't attack, attack Aldo first, we're screwed. He's an NPC, he can't answer. Well, at least she got the heal. Uh, I got that off first. Uh, poison arrow and striking blade. Oh god! As long as he doesn't do that again, we're fine. Okay. Well, we got we kind of got screwed because we can't heal. We don't have actual healing magic. Are we, are we healed up, by the way? Yeah, okay. And we got kind of screwed because we can't... There, we don't have healing magic, so I can't heal between fights. So when that lava snail called in three reinforcements and just beat the crap out of us, I had no option. And if you come back here, oh, Lord, like this... Everybody's back. Okay, we didn't get as badly screwed in the way back here. Like, we only had two fights where they summoned, like, two extra allies, and then it was a little rough. We also get two more levels on the way back, so... We're a lot better off right now. Much better off. Okay.
sweet. Okay. Very weird play. Well, I mean, they also got King Possible down to like the exact detail, so obviously they're going through the historical records. I mean, mana, people knew mana existed. Alright, this quest has to be being close to being done. Let's see if we can't just finish this one out really fast. Hooray! No one finds this weird at all. This is awkward. Yeah, we broke it. We broke it good. Wow, you know, I made the Doc Hat reference uh, a while ago, but this is really getting there. I'm just gonna go system shock on us, and it's gonna be a whole different kind of game. Talking to, to, to her? Oh, well, in that case, yeah, nothing to fear at all. Of course not. You've seen these before, Aldo. This is the third time, man. Okay, that's new. Wow, that's even more awkward.
You think? Okay, but we'll check on that next time. Okay, so this is getting interesting. So this is how it's turning out. It really, I mean, I'm assuming we're not gonna be going through, is there is this MMO we have to do for stuff, but I wonder if we're gonna start doing normal things in the normal dream world and just having to be like this MMO, but we'll find out next time. So this is getting interesting. We're already leveled up pretty good. All those got his best available weapons, so. We're doing good there, and we'll find out what happens next time. So, until then, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.